All right, John back. And like I said in the other one, yes, I am a little bit tipsy. Just a little bit. Ugh, and still sick. So she's trying to cut me off, and I'm trying to tell Max. Oh yeah, look, and he and 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 it, I was gonna say it's a nice picture. Never mind the fact that this bitch then came in a nappy ass bun. Now, bitch, I girl, she, I guess she thought I was trying to talk to him, but bitch, I'm sitting here next to my motherfucking husband. I know him from way back, girl. You ain't no need to do that in that ugly motherfucking, as he said, carry dress. And uh, so she's like, they. She hits me with the. Oh. Y'all know I hit her. I hit her with the nappy head, bitch. I'm not trying to get at your man. I'm just. I'm. I'm saying y'all got nice pictures. And I was trying to ask if they like had like where if you bought three of them, you get three for a certain amount or whatever. It, it just wasn't that serious. So. Then the wobble comes up. She gets this long ass motherfucking goddess status gown. She gets up like, you know, he grabs her chair and I'm like, he's such a gentleman or whatever. It was just really, really sweet. Y'all can see it. I got like embellishments on my shit. It was really like an evening like type of thing. Okay. So she getting up, getting ready to do the wobble and shit. And she's. You know, like, Max, get my seat. So, you know, the bitches all but doing the motherfucking parade wave and shit. You know, I'm I'm sitting there next to my husband, and he's hoping I ain't get ready to act the motherfucking fool, because apparently I must embarrass him from time to time. And so, sorry, y'all. So, uh, I'm watching, and they do the wobble. You know, everybody's going up, and I got that on my, my video, too. And I'm like, I'm trying to watch, because, of course, I, you know, I can't get out and, and do that. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to answer this with Brittany. Yes, Brittany. Hey, Mom. Hey, baby. How you doing? Well, child, you know your mammy's lit. I've been to the thing, and, I, and I'm just making a video about the whole function and all that and it's a hoot i cannot wait to tell you candace damn near knocked your dad your granddad out with her titties i ain't even made it to that point yet huh candace uh. so i'm making a video but i decided to go on and answer the skype is something wrong no i just i just want to i ain't got nobody to talk to this one brent's up Brent's here. Is he over? Yeah. Uh, He's down there. He's up though. Uh, all right. Oh, I love it. Right. I love you too. I love you too, baby. Bye. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. I had to answer for my baby. Okay. So that might be on somebody's pet peeve. Don't ask your motherfucking Skype number when you're doing a video. That's going to be on somebody's next pet, pet, pet peeve, but that's okay. So, and we will get to the titty part. So she gets up and goes and the wobble's on. And I'm thinking, you know, because I've seen Max, he'll throw all the way down. He'll just, he'll be all in it. You know, and I'm thinking that she can go out and do the wobble with everybody else. You know, wobble, baby, wobble. You know, the whole wobble. Did this bitch just go out there and do the motherfucking waltz? I know she heard the song wobble. She tried to go out there and do, I mean, everybody else in the lad all the world in the club and getting it up, check it up, you know, doing the whole thing. And this bitch is out there waltzing. Never had grand bitch. Yes, I said it because y'all, she deserved this one. Y'all would have had to see her. And I do believe she on the video. I'm going to edit that shit and let y'all see what the hell I'm talking about. This motherfucking big motherfucking bud, bitch. I'm trying to say, oh, y'all pictures are nice, girl. You getting on red a motherfucking alert. Like this bitch trying to holler at my motherfucking man. girl, boo. <sighs> anyway, let's see. On to the next shit. So. We ate and stuff, and my husband got the food and all that, which was really, really good. It was roast beef, and they had some, they had 
all kinds of fruit and sap, just all kinds of stuff. You know, homemade roll. They had everything. And it was delicious. You know, they had pies and stuff. And it was really delicious. It was really nice. Um, they did, uh, you know, after after everybody ate or whatever, it was time to really, she just kind of, the DJ kind of kicked it up. And, you know, they was really in it. And they played the new Wobble and, uh, you know, all of the new shit. Because they do a lot of line, line dancing here, you know, in Kentucky. They do. They just notorious for that. You know, they get up for that shit. They still doing the motherfucking electric slab, which that motherfucker gonna be around forever. So, then she played my song, Gene Chandler, The Rainbow. I ain't gonna cut it on here because they might cut my video off. It might be some copywritten ass shit. They played my song. I got into it. I had me a couple of drinks or whatever because they had the bar and all of that. <clears throat> you know, the drinks in there. So my dad gets me one and then I'm kind of in and y'all, Jack Daniel was what I was having tonight. I was really trying to big wig it. So I'm looking at my mama had a few and she looks really, really nice. I'm just really happy because it's 30 years and it means a lot, you know what I mean, to her. So let me see what else happened. So, oh, y'all, let me tell y'all about the dude. Let me see if I can find something that can be in the motherfucking background. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Because I got to have some music to show y'all. Let me see. Okay. Let's see. Is this it? Can y'all hear that? Like that one, tell me. So, let's say the music on, and I looked over at the corner of my motherfucking shit. Y'all know what? A motherfucker on the low will always get his key up for me. I guess I've been looking at it too motherfucking long. You know, so he's over there doing the, you know, just doing the straight dude kind of, I ain't really trying to dance or whatever. I don't know what the fuck happened. I don't know if his part of the song came on and he broke from doing the slow dude bop and I can't do it like he was doing it because, you know, I'm not a man. Yo, his part came on. He was like, like, I mean, just the woman just came out at him. He was like, yes. And I was like, <laughs> looking at my album, you know, like, and I know his woman, she had this look on her face, like, because he was just straight dude, and then apparently that's one of his songs he used to hear when he go to the balls and the functions with the children, when they not together, and that came on, honey, he was just, I was like, Cause I would have took my motherfucking pills, her and everything off and fuck my husband up and be the anything suspect. Trust. And I'm looking, I'm like, and his wife the whole night after that was like, this is like it's him. I said, mm -hmm, that's a bitch gonna walk in on some motherfucking wronger track. So okay, so that was that was that one. Let me see what else. Then okay, one of my mother's club members, her daughter, her name, her daughter. I ain't gonna say her name. Anyway, and I might have already said her name. So she like gets my dad to dance because my mama's sitting there like next to me and my auntie and she's having a good time they had a few and she would always say when i when when i was younger my mother always entertained and had a club and all of that and she would come in and i would be young and she would be like yeah your mammy's lit she would say mammy your mammy's lit mm -hmm, your mammy lit and dad would be like nancy come on let me let's get on in here and you need to sit your ass down somewhere. So she lit. And we talking or whatever. And so Candace ease over in this motherfucking brush cotton. Below Valanche. I can't even. I don't know, y'all. Below Valanche or something. And she's like, come on, Skippy. 
So dad gets up because he ain't really get up. He, he'll get up and dance by himself a little bit. And if mama's feeling it and can do it, she will. And for those who don't know, my girl Keisha, whatever, she's talked to my dad or whatever. A few, Jahira. Uh, y'all, he think he a pimp. His favorite motherfucking line is pimping ain't easy. And my mama said, you ain't got but one motherfucking hoe. And I ain't working. You know, they just an inside joke with them. So he gets up and goes up there and tries to dance. And this is what kills me, y'all. And I'm top heavy, my motherfucking set. But when you extra top heavy, your dance should not begin with, you know, it's just, you know, just ain't even no side to side. It's just, you know, <laughs> she done whooped the shit out of my daddy. And I leaned back and looked at Baba. She said, I thought you was going to say something about her wig. I thought you was going to say she whooped the hell out of your great, your daddy with her. Y'all, soon as she got out there, it wasn't even a, y'all know the little side, you know, you get ready out of a little clap that you do. Nah, it was straight on. <laughs> this. <laughs> said, why? What is she doing? She gonna whoop my dad deaf. He trying to step back and she's <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell? I can't take it. I'm steady sipping the whole time. So they do dancing or whatever. Me and my mom and my auntie, we laughing and shit and we talking. And I was like, Mama, don't do it. Don't put the stop spotlight on it. But needless to say, it was a good time. The wolf wasn't there. I didn't have to cut her bitch ass. I didn't have to act no fool. Uh, none of that. I had a wonderful time with my husband, my mother, dad, and family that was there. You know, and it was family, some family there, but a lot of people that has been patronizing after my mother, you know, for a long time. And this was 30 years. And like, um, she went up at the end and I was so, you know, I'm filming or whatever. And I'm all kind of like, oh, look at my mama and going through the whole bit. It was just kind of I don't know. It was just a little nostalgic. It was, there was a point where I was kind of like, woo woo. Cause I remember when my best friend, you know, y'all know the one that's, he's gone. But we started out going and helping my mother back when I was like 16, you know, when me and him was the same age. And it just was just like 30 years or whatever, you know, later or whatever. And it wasn't 30 years that we was helping or whatever. But just thinking about it, just all the people that have came and went and all of that and the things that I've seen and, you know, just all of that. But it was a good time. The wolf wasn't there. Hopefully I didn't bore y'all to pieces. Um, I did get a lot on video. So all I got to do is edit and all of that. So. Including, I think I did a thing just showing the whole thing I had on, actually. It's really kind of cute, and I look much better earlier. Everything's pretty much gone now. You know, off of me, I done rubbed, I done laughed, I done heard my song, I done hugged, and I ain't seen you in forever, and flirted with my husband, and y'all know. Y'all know the whole bit, but it was a good time. And I just wanted to come in and tell y'all, sorry about Brittany calling and breaking in. Bear with me. And I'm trying to think. Hopefully I didn't forget nothing. If I forgot something, it's all on the video. So I'm going to get that edited and up for y'all. But it was a good time. So anywho, y'all, I'm going to go take this shit off. Hope I can take my face off. I ain't going to fake the funk. I might go to damn sleep with this shit on. But I'm going to try to go ahead and take my makeup off or whatever and hang my things up and you know, the whole bit. I'm out of here, y'all. I will chit-chat with y'all and do... I know I'm supposed to do the video today, Ringa, that will come tomorrow. Promise. Ringa and I think it's Models, the uh, Merkel's Next Top Model, whatever the fuck, tomorrow. So I'm out of here, y'all. Much love.